This video shows how to solve this problem uh, in Angular when you are in the uh, component TS file and you've in it some variables in here. Then you will see a property uh, of something uh, has no initializer, say so, initializer and is not defined assigned in the constructor TS2564. So how to solve this? There are several ways, but one is the easiest way. Uh, when you click on there, when you are on there, you see this one drop down the bulb and then you say undefined. So this is one way. Let's say when you start with your app, then it's not defined. That's one way. So put this back. You may do this behind every uh, stuff. Then you have the other one solution, this one. Uh, go there and set here the uh, if not uh, or is null if it's null or not uh, null so it's nullable let's say this is one solution it's open and then uh, uninitialized properties uh, I don't know about this one yeah I see now it did this one it added it everywhere so this where this is also c quite common uh, now in C sharp you have to set uh, that it's null but also the best one of those easy solutions is that you go into your ts config here and in, in the ts config you type in there strict property initialization to false and as you and as you do this and say uh, so this is ts config uh, is the way how it's uh, compiled or looked up so and now when you do saving and go back to your file then we'll see that everything is gone. 